So there's a new version of Smart Valve, which has now been released for Seven Trent Water. So this is version 2.2. So when you go to the App Store, you'll see version 2.2 will be displayed. And this version has a new user interface. So there's another video that's going to be done on that, just a quick walk around. The functionality remains the same. There's been some fixes and some upgrades behind the scenes as well. Um, but obviously when you go to download your new version of the app and when you get to your login screen you must remember to put in your CVSE number so this is just a quick reminder on how to do that so when you launch your app for the first time this is a screen that you will see so up in the top right hand corner I click the cog and there you'll have your CSVE number so this is the same one that you'll have been provided before so if you ask someone in the project team, so Richard Brandt or Hayley Whitehouse, they'll be able to provide you with this. You'll only have to put this in once. We don't envisage on adding anything else to the app for the remainder of the 7 Trent trial. So once you've put that in there and press the save, so you just type in there and it'll always start with HTTPS. And then there'll be a code on forward slash forward slash. And then there'll be a series of letters um, and dots in there, which is a URL. So once you've done that, press save. Then you'll go down to your login. You log in with your username, which is your 7Trent email address and your password, which any of you know, hit login, and that will get you into the new version of the app. So we hope that everyone downloads that first thing on Monday the 29th of June. That should be available for you. So just remember CVSE number in, username and password. And then I will do another video which will be sent out uh, via Richard, via WhatsApp teams on having a look at the new design layer that sits on top of the app.